recognize the presence of the Mutiny Public Procurement Agency in the United States. You're welcome, sir. Um, I also recognize my colleagues from state to state. I also say welcome to the Censor team who will be handling the talks. We, we in state to state are glad that you are here. Each time we call you, you come. We appreciate you for coming and we say welcome. Now I'm here to uh, speak just to ha um, give you an overview, to remind ourselves, because some of us have heard this before, of uh, why state to state is here. As you all know, state to state is a USID interventionist program. We, state to state operates on three levels. We, um, we, um, we have uh, three pillars, which we call soft purposes. Whatever we do are anchored or stem from these uh, three substances. The major aim of state to state, the overall aim of whatever we do, is to see an increase in the efficiency of subnational governments, the operations of, of the states. We, we want to see that there is efficiency. And how do we do this? It is by strengthening governance systems, especially the PFM system. It's not because I'm an accountant, but the truth is that go up, go down. Any organization that you run, so long as you use money to run it, you will need, in fact, you will need prudent financial management to be able to run it effectively. So what state to state has only just come to do is to help the states. When we say subnational government, governments, we are talking about states and local governments. So it is to help, in this instance, when the state to strengthen its public financial management system, the procurement system, to be efficient in its operations. So that at the end of the day, our resources will be used efficiently. And when, when the resources are used efficiently, we all start to gain. We'll be seeing what the government is using the money, our money, to accomplish. So that's sub for sub purpose one, which deals essentially with the public financial uh, management. The second one is uh, sub purpose two, which aims to see that government, subnational government, responds to the needs of the citizens and their priorities. How do we do that? It is by engaging the citizens, just like we have done now, to be part of the governance of the state. The test of purpose deals with strengthening the capacities of subnational governments. Like I said before, when we say subnational governments, we are talking about the state and we are talking about the local governments. We, under subpurpose three, we aim to strengthen the capacities of subnational governments to be able to manage conflicts. You know, no matter how good you are in planning, you cannot plan where there is no peace. If there are conflicts, you will hardly be able to do anything right. In fact, you go to your drawing board and finish your planning, draw up your action plans, you will not be able to execute them. So we need a stable society 
devoid of rancors, conflicts, to be able to have good governance. So, we need a sub three sub process. We summarize what the state, uh, the state, state to state activity has come to do in the states. And with that, I say welcome again. And I'm sure that as usual, for it to be a participatory thing, it's not for you to just sit down and watch, because we know that there are things you know even better than we do. And those that we want to hear from you, we want you to make contributions, it's our thing. It's not us teaching you, it's us interacting and exchanging ideas to see how we can bring about efficiency in the operations of governance in the United States. Thank you very much for all of you.